Yad A. I'm Dr. Joe Shirley Jr., President of the Navajo Nation. Since our election in 2003, the First Lady and I made it our goal to provide an improved quality of life for all of our people. We pledge to promote healthy behaviors and to educate and protect young Navajos. We aspire to help our Diné by strengthening the vitality of each Navajo community. Through the Navajo Nation Office of the President, we implemented quality of life standards for health that included the development of the Navajo Nation Selective Traffic Enforcement Program, known as the STEP Team. Working with the Office of the Navajo Nation First Lady, from the beginning, the team was up against incredible odds. Combating drunk driving that results in injuries and fatalities. Since 1964, the number one cause of fatality on the Navajo Nation has been motor vehicle accidents. Crashes that result in fatalities that could be stopped simply by getting unsafe drivers off the roads and enhancing safe driving behaviors among our people. The problem we identified was completely preventable by responsible driving and responsible individuals. One police officer out of the eight Navajo police districts was asked to join STEP, and they eagerly answered the call. A selective traffic enforcement program was created. Since then, a strong commitment has been built by the STEP team members to create a plan to stop and arrest drunk drivers and stop those driving carelessly on Navajo highways. Despite a lack of funding and resources, the Navajo Nation STEP team went to work. They gathered data to identify which types of incidences were occurring and the number of arrests being made. They found ways that would make Navajo land roads safe. My hope as president is that we can achieve safety for ourselves, our families, and the Navajo Nation through this effort. Every one of us, from our young children, students in buses, and our elderly use our highways and deserve to travel safely. As a people, we are responsible for our own safety, as well as that of others. It is our tradition passed down to us. Our people have survived much and shouldn't have to face the prospect of surviving just to get from place to place on our highways. All of us should do what we can to help each other with kindness, respect, and safety. Let it be everyone's wish that we never ever lose another life, another loved one, because of a preventable vehicle crash. I ask everyone to exercise respect, show courtesy, and to drive safely on our roads. Let it be your duty to help keep our people safe.
bring liquor onto the reservation or if you're drinking and driving, you will get arrested. This is Navajo Nation Police Department and the message I want to send out out there is texting and also driving while on your cell phone. Uh, so everybody needs to drive safe because those two also can cause accidents. It's just the same as DUI driving. This is uh, the Navajo Nation, Navajo Police Department. Always wear your safety belt at all times and also buckle up and then also um, make sure your, your child sit in the car seat, make sure they're also buckle up. Like you wear your safety belt. Drive safe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good to see you. Uh, drive safe that way.